feel like I grew up here. Uh, I spent a lot of time right here on this very stage. It was the same campground and uh, back there at the Saudi Bottom Pavilion. Uh, just out at 2, 3 o'clock in the morning. Mom and Dad would, would be here, but they'd already be in bed inside the camper waiting on them to get back. Uh, but a lot of great memories were made right here in this very spot. And it all kind of started for me back at a music store called the Bluegrass Parlor, and some of you may remember that place. Yeah, I, I got a lot of fond memories of that place, and Tom Henderson and, and everyone that was uh, there every first night in the jam session. There was one guy in particular, his name was Ken Folsom, and you may remember Ken. He had a couple of different nicknames, and uh, one of them being Sunshine, but he always had a smile on his face and always had a positive spirit about him. And he taught me more about life than anybody I think I ever met. He was a World War II veteran. He came home with two broken hearts. And uh, the story, as I can remember it the best that I can, is that he was on a mission. He became injured, and everyone else around him was injured and dying. And he started grabbing soldiers and dragging them back as far as he could in safety. And I don't remember what the total count was on the men that he saved. But in the process, he picked up a little nickname uh, called the Rapido Kid. So I named this little team after him. <laughs> 